Today's video is brought to you by Black Rifle Coffee Company. Well, the sun's just coming up. We've got her pinched in the box here. So right off the bat, I like to clean her bag and her teed off with some warm water so we don't get any of that in the milk. So once I've cleaned her off well, I'm gonna go ahead, place my bucket in place here. And then one plus is she's really used to getting milk, so she kind of knows the routine, so she's gonna stand really gently. Um, but sometimes you wanna be prepared to move your bucket out really quick if the cow's gonna kick at a fly or something else. But I, I grab the teat by the top and kind of firmly, but not squeezing too hard, squeeze down to get a big stream of milk, as you can see right here. And then I do it again, back up, let it fill up, let the teat fill with milk. And I start here, and literally it's just a squeezing process. Now, I've seen some people do it with a folded thumb, like this. And I'm not really pulling hard on the teat. I'm literally just coming in and I'm squeezing slowly and draining it out. So when you want to go fast, you can see I'm really getting milk from both the teats here at one time and I'm filling my bucket up. Having a milk cow is absolutely awesome. You get fresh milk, you got cream for your coffee, you can make cheese, you can make butter, you can make ice cream, you can make all kinds of stuff. It's really simple. Once you get this routine down right here, then you're golden. One of the other pluses is we enjoy some Black Rifle coffee in the morning and we get some fresh cream for it. 